Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to the farm. It's Saturday, so I'm on chore duty. Well, chicken chore duty. I'm always on chore duty, but um, Saturdays are my kind of designated day to kind of get it all done. Um, the kids go with grandma and grandpa. market so we're gonna let the chickens out and uh, let my um, my calves are starving they're needy they tell me all about it can you guys hear them bawling they never ball like that well they ball like that when they're hungry it's very soupy um, we've had rain my rain dance worked. Now I need to be like doing like a rain dance to stop it. Um, if you caught that, that was on Instagram. Um, you can follow us around on social media. Links below. But um, yeah, today I'm just kind of doing a catch up. Got some stalls I need to work on. Uh, Mo's not coming out today. She has been helping quite a bit with just um, the day-to-day -day chores, like with the horses and the calves and stuff that I don't always. Well, sure. Hold on, I need to find my little herpy step thing. It's not here. It's not here. Okay, well I guess I'll have to go find, oh, there it is. I just can't see. I'm gonna have to put you guys down. So some of you guys asked about the chickens. I'll try to talk loud as they come out. Um, they're in their summer trailers. We do rotational um, pasteurized chickens. Um, these are all laying hens. And they're kind of wet and damp because it's been raining for like the last three days, four days. But we rotate these chicken trailers around. Um, right now they're kind of in the designated dry lot area. So they just have free grass. Um, we do not do any meat chickens. They're all laying chickens because the kids take about 80 to 100 dozen down to Lake St. Louis on Saturdays. Plus we uh, try to uh, keep our neighbors happy with chicken eggs. So it's their little entrepreneurship project that Grandma and Grandpa started for them. It's so loud. Um, I'm working on trying to get a new like trailer video um for you guys to share with other like new subscribers kind of giving you guys a background of who we are without having to go like all the way back from like the very first video because there's like 300 out there um i really enjoy sharing and taking you guys along so when you guys hit subscribe and you guys like and leave comments that helps other people find our channel too as we continue to grow um Jason and I really like to go live. He, that's more his thing. Um, we just haven't had time, but we're trying to do a better job about it. We want to make sure we're trying to go live at least once a month, maybe more. If I can figure out, I know guys, just have some patience. I'll be right there. They're like children. Um, if I can figure out a way to do it from the tractor, I want to take you guys live one afternoon as we bail. I just got to figure out where I can get good enough service to do that with. But without you guys subscribing, without you guys commenting and encouraging and sending me the emails and the handwritten letters to the house, you guys, that means so much to us. Well, more to me because Jason's just like, whatever, Kayla, do what you want. But um, it means so much to me that you guys take time out of your all's day to watch, to comment, and be a part of our farm family too. So I am going to tour the horses um, this morning and then I may sneak Scooter out and just do a little quick ride and work out since I'm here by myself today. We'll see, we'll see. Hello, how are you bays doing today? Good, Shiloh? 
Cooking that baby? Yeah? So we're just bringing home my tractor from the field. Um, we don't have anything to shoot bail, nothing down, so we're very blessed that we didn't ruin any hay, but there's a lot of water standing. Um, it's given Jason and I just a little bit of time to catch up and breathe and relax a little bit in the last few days. Um, and we still have five more days of rain coming over the next several days, so. There's the wheat field that we did from last week. They have not gotten any more off, unfortunately. And it's kind of down. So I'm not real sure if they're going to come back and cut any more of it. Or, uh, I don't know. Then maybe this week I'll have some time to, like, uh, go see my sister and get my hair touched up. Is he? Okay. No, I would like to keep Valor, um, that bald red faced baby, and there was one more. 64's baby, maybe? So the whole herd is here besides those 25 yearlings. And the creek is just up too much for us to combine them at the moment with all the rain we've had. Who is it? Yeah. I know, I noticed that the other day, yesterday when we moved them.